Hello everybody, and welcome back to some more Valkyria Chronicles. Oh my god, that last mission was so long. And it was brutal, and I almost lost Alicia, and I don't know if I'm ever going to get over it. I would say that I would keep her in the back for forever and ever, but I'm not going to because she's still my best unit. And, yeah. Mm. Okay, uh, like, so, so, between... Uh, last time and this time, I did get a hankering to play some, uh, play some more missions, but I didn't want to commit to doing, like, a whole other chapter. So, I went and I did a couple of the skirmishes. So, I've saved up a little bit of money. I gave uh, a couple of my classes a little bit more level ups. Let's hop into chapter 8. Having been driven back... The Empire retreated from Barius, and Squad 7 began its return to the capital of Randgris. I'm worried, boss. The scouts were due back a long time ago. I haven't heard a thing. Welkin, we should look. The enemy could be closer than we think. Right. Oh, no good. No good. No good at all. No good at all. Well, that's bad. Well, hold on. Where are you going? Don't be an idiot. Who's going to drive the tank if you get hurt? Largo, we've got to move our butts now. Two more minutes and we'll be dead. Damn. <laughs> no choice. It's an ambush. Well numbered. Everybody take cover. Come on, Isara. Now. Right. Oh, this is bad. Where? Uh, uh, Welkin? Oh, good. You're awake. Where are we? Is everyone all right? It looks like we got separated when that blast threw us down here. Oh. Alicia. There are probably still Imperials camped out up there. It's just a matter of time until they spot us here. We should move as soon as we can. Are you hurt anywhere? Do you think you can walk? I think I'm fine. Ah, scratch that. I think my ankle sprained, actually. Aw, oh, damn it! No, this is because I almost got her killed, isn't it? Yeah, the story is evolving. But I should be okay. It's not too bad to walk on. Sorry, I know it hurts, but you've got to tough it out for now. Of course. Great. Now, let's try to sneak out of this mess before we're spotted. Yeek, yeek, yeek. All right, one sec. Got to throw down my sound dampening cloth. Oh, right! This was the one that had two combat missions. And, okay, so the first one is just gonna be, uh, these guys, it looks like. Alicia, here's a map of the area. It looks like they've got us surrounded. You'll only be two units out there and your positions are predetermined. Great! So this is, like, stealth. You must reach the destination to the north to escape the perimeter they've set up out there. Due to darkness, you'll be dealing with far more limited visibility than you're accessed to. You'll see no sight lines for enemies more than a set distance away and unable to see them in action mode. Oh, shit. You don't have access to the wireless communication equipment in your tank, meaning no orders. All right. Ready to start moving? Let's sneak out of their perimeter without being spotted. So this isn't a combat mission, this is a stealth ops mission, and we just need to survive. Wow, it's really gotten dark. The lack of light means it's harder to see enemies in the distance, so watch out. Ow! Is your ankle gonna make Oh it? crap, and she's only got like half movement, right? Sorry, I don't know how much I can run like this. 
That's all right. You set the pace and I'll follow. Enemy long range mortar is set to fire. What are they just bombing Does that shit? Sound a mortar? Have they spotted us? No, their aim is too far off. They're probably trying to scare us out with it. If we're careful, we can predict where they'll fire and steer clear of the target area. It sounds like there's no music here either. All right, one, one more sec, one more sec. Yeah, okay, and I'm back. My turn, okay? <laughs> Can't beat the smell of fresh soil. Yeah. Oh, oh crap. Oh, she's only got as much distance as a shock trooper now. <sighs> Very not good. Very not good. Yeah. That looks like a hell of a sprain, girl. Um, what is that sound? What is that sound? Does that mean I'm walking into the mortar, or is that like the fireflies? Enemy unit spotted. Oh. Um. Come on, Alicia. Use them sniper skills. Oh, yes, even on a weak angle. You know how to aim. That's my girl. Okay, so I have directly put her into the combat zone. The mortar fire. Welkin can catch up. She's got to she's got to keep walking. The smell of fresh soil. She's got to make it out the other side. Have you made it? Are you far enough? Yes. Okay, good. Ready to go. Good. Welkin's still got the full scout movement, so I should be able to just catch right up to her. And then some. Also, stab you. Gotta love nature. Okay, so I get a thing from this. Hey, Welkin, what's that light? Oh, that's a luciferant. It's bioluminescent, the same sort of thing as a firefly. Hey, wait. The luciferant feeds mostly on manure. There could be an animal trail here. With luck, it might let us sneak past without the enemy spotting us. Ooh, interesting. Oh? Oh, okay. Because there was another one way back there, right? And then it would lead me back around here, but now I want to know what that blue thing is. So, Alicia, you keep on running next turn. I'm going to go check that out. They're just doing some shuffle shuffling. He is literally just running around in a circle, like a patrol route or something. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, and that takes out the trees. That's wonderful. Ready to go. So Gotta what is this? Nature. Found an herb that he helps heal injuries. Bring uh, bring Alicia here to apply it. Damn it. I was supposed to bring both of them back here, wasn't I? Shit. Searchlights. This is bad news. What do you figure will happen if they see us? They'll radio our location to the mortars, and we'll see them land a whole lot closer. Not high on my list of good things. We'd better keep our heads down out here. So, duck around. Gotta love nature. So, I'm gonna have Welkin hang out up here. 
It looks like he's just out of range of the mortar fire. Turn, okay? I'm going to send Alicia down to that herb to see what happens there. Because if I can get anything to help her run a little bit more, I want to. I wonder if she knows how to apply it, though, or if I have to have Welkin here to do it. Gah! And there's no option to just restart the map. Son of a bitch. Alright, I guess I'll just have to hope I come across another one then. Like, I'll keep my eye out, but I'm... Ah, son of a... I'm just wasting time now, I know. Fence down. Yeek. Now. Okay. My turn, okay? Go hang out by your stupid plant. I don't know why you couldn't do this your damn self. Ready to go. Welcome so close to it too. All right, there was a mine there. I forgot about that. Okay, fine. These leaves. Great. This is Ponisera. What's up, Welkin? It's a wild herb that works well on bruises. Just have to grind the stem and leaves down. Alicia, let me put this on your ankle. It... it kind of stings. But I think it hurts a little less now. Thank you, Welkin. Okay, let's push on ahead. We might find more Ponisera growing nearby. Of course we will. Ah, after I wasted so long getting back here. All right, got to keep my eye open. From here on out, got to keep my eye open. What she got now? That's actually a considerable increase in run speed. Or in run distance, I guess. So, I'm going to go ahead and say that was probably worth it. We are losing a lot of tree cover as these as these guys keep firing. Right, right, do your shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Run around in a circle. Be faster about it now. No more trees. J that area again. Okay, so they're just gonna keep shooting that spot until we pass by it. That's what their Can game turn, is here. Okay? Do I have to sneak down that way to get more of the plant? Is that what's up? That is the way that'll take us past without getting in the mortar fire. So let's try it. Go faster, go faster, go faster, 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 faster! Faster! Oh, God. Awful lot of mines there. Hmm. Okay, we're out of sight of the searchlights, which is good. Here we go. Thank you, 
Nope, nope, nope. Don't get greedy now. Have Welkin follow up behind. Keep an eye out for more fireflies and leaves. No more plants down that way. And where is this light searching? It does seem to go across the grass. No, wait, it doesn't go across the grass. I can totally hide in there. Okay, good. I really hope. Come on. Come on now, don't catch my foot. Very good, very good. My turn, okay? Now she's gonna be harder to get through, but this is still a really wide berth. We got time. And I don't see any of them plants around here, so I should probably just keep moving forward. Well, not with this little run speed. Uh, I'm pretty sure if I tried... Yes, there's another one up there. Okay, good. So we can hit that plant next time. Still no new trees down, but now we know they're going to mortar a little farther up the path. Yes, right there. Hmm. My turn, okay? So she's still top priority. And we got to wait for this to get by. And go. Go, go, go. Go faster. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, okay, I think we're safe. Ready to go. <laughs> You're up, Welks. Let it pass. Up, oh, go, go, go. Gotta love nature. All right, let's get some more of that run speed back. Alicia, here's some more Ponisera. Let's get this on that ankle. All right. Oh, thanks. It hurts even less now. That's good, but still, don't push yourself. I don't know if I agree with that advice. You kind of got to push yourself. We're out here talking life or death situations. Things are trying to mortar and shoot Enemy us in sighted. the head. Oh, God. Oh, I saw two. There's another one behind that tree. Down. Oh god, okay, okay, so you can see me here. Come on, oh, come on, man, that would have been a really dick move. Oh shit, even if I can perfect headshot him, I'm... Hmm... I might be stuck. He's gonna counter shot. Welkin's dead. Okay, well at least now I can do it properly from, uh, step one. So I'll get back to you guys when I get back to that spot. Oh, son of a bitch, it caught me in the foot. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! Okay, uh, and we're back. Like, uh, right at the exact same place. Like, uh, I've, I've just, uh, like, uh, given Alicia... Enemy sighted! Yeah, uh, her second shot. Like, uh, of that Pontifera plant. Um... And now, like, uh, now we run into these guys again. And... Like, I'm, I'm not entirely sure... Uh, how... Uh, how best to proceed here? Like, I don't want to leave uh, without killing that guy. Like, that Ty the Immortal guy right there. Uh, I know that he's a special enemy unit. If I take him out, like, I get a gun or something. 
But because of that, he can take like six headshots and not die. And I don't... Okay. Yes! Okay. Yes, yes. Uh, I can... Gotta love nature. Yeah, uh, get close enough uh, to him to still duck down in the grass. And that's another firefly path. Hmm. I kind of want to try to just take out this scout right now. But I can't. He's behind the tree, of course. Can't really get a better... Nope, nope, nope. If I get any closer, he's going to start pot shotting me with his... Dude, stop! Christ! Uh, I might, like, uh, just have to make a concentrated effort, like, with both of them trying to take headshots if I want to have any chance of taking this guy down. Oh my god. Come on! Like, that's not even kind of fair. I'm well out of sight range of him. Yes, you. You are also an asshole. Cut that out. Cut it out immediately. <sighs> now I don't know what to do because I can't leave her standing here. I might have to have her duck behind the fence again, but first I have to hope that she can land this kill. Or else she's she's dead. She's just dead. That's my girl! I know I can rely on you. And you with the machine gun, you're an asshole. I'm sick of your shit. Leave me alone. Okay. So they're not doing anything this round. Interesting. Should I take a full round to heal up before I, you know, try to make an effort at him? My turn, okay? I think that sounds like the best idea because I don't want to leave with him still alive. Like, I want to take him out. Speed is a secondary concern. Here we go. Maybe Welkin can get close enough if he keeps using that tree as cover. Like, close enough to throw a grenade at him. Knock him out into a better position. Because that would be really handy. And they're not doing anything with their guys anymore. Like, they're just having him kind of stand there. Ready to go. <sighs> Gotta love nature. So I'm gonna have to make a break for it between that spotlight making its rounds. It's way better when it goes off to the right. Don't catch me, don't catch me. Okay. And fuck you. Yes, that is a really good shot. End it. End it really quick. Don't let him get some interception shots on you. Turn, now okay. he's far enough away that I can... Uh, bring a leash around the corner. Get her hunkered, hiding. Line it up. Take the shots. Dodging. Can't dodge. Very good. Boom! Three headshots in a row. Nicely done, Alicia. You my girl. All right, get up. Go, 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 go. Okay. Okay. 
Ah, uh, okay, so those fireflies would have just taken me around or I wouldn't have to deal with them. I see. Well, I wanted to do things uh, the hard way. I also don't want to go too far up there because I'm pretty sure this puts me into mortar territory. So for now, let's say we just kind of hide out right here. Make sure we're not walking into a trap. Yep, if I'd gone around there, I would have been basically signing up for death. Here we go. Maybe I can get Welkin around the corner, though, and scout it out. Ooh, ooh. Another herb. Oh, oh, the fireflies would have taken me out here. Okay. So I'm going to hide here for now. Okay, well out of the range. Um My turn, okay? How far away were those flies? Could I still duck in? This might be a much easier way of getting back there. Don't catch me, okay? Duck, 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 duck. Okay, okay, very good, very, very good. Together. Make your way up here. Try to get a little bit closer. Okay, it's still out of range. But we made it through there. We killed Ty. That's very good. They're still doing nothing with their men. Bring her up to the flower. Here we go. Oh, gotta love nature. Go get that last bit on, and then she should have a full running range. Ooh, there's some more Ponisera again. Oh, the pain's mostly gone now. Thanks again. I'm just glad it's working. So, welcome. Um. Is that stuff edible? Why? Are you hungry? Huh? No. I'm just... I wondered if I could use it in a new bread recipe. Oh, I see. Well, the flowers have a sweet nectar to them, so it could be good. Ah, you tease me. We're sneaking around the woods and you're thinking of baking bread. I don't want to hear it, nature boy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Well, let's move on. That was a gorgeous face you were just pulling there, Alicia. Uh, I know why you are my frontline girl. Duck! Oh god, that was way too close. So, I know that the mortars were facing in this direction this time. But I'm wondering if I could still duck away if I, like, hid back here in the firefly... Oh, so these fireflies just take me to a safe spot. I see what's up with this. Yeah, because that mortar is, like, hitting this whole area. Alright, well, let's just end it there. Alicia's already made a run, so she's low on walking power. We'll get two moves for both of them next time. And we have one more searchlight to push through. Turn seven. Man, we are just really rocking this level. We're flying through. Ah! Okay. So we avoid the mine. Stop for a moment and observe the loop. And Alicia's out. Looks like I managed to sneak past all right. I wonder if Welkin's almost here. Ready 
ready to go. This will be no problem for my boy Wilkes. In fact, you know what? Hey! I'm right here, guys. Come find me. Whoop, 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 whoop. Phew. We should be safe here, at least for a little while. Let's look for a spot where we can rest. Right. It's too dark to cover much ground even if we tried. Rank C! I done it! Enemy leader bonus and enemy ace bonus. I still got 21 thou. Oh my god, it's so hot here. Who'd build a cottage way out here? Not that I'm complaining or anything. Ooh, we found a cabin in the woods. How's your ankle holding up? Sorry to make you walk They're so They're gonna far. get all lovey-dovey. No, it's not too bad. Don't worry. That's good. Still, let's get an herbal compress on it just in case. It just figures you'd know about herbs, Welkin. <laughs> well, this here is called aloe severa. It's a succulent in the lily family. There's a jelly substance inside its leaves that helps combat swelling. <laughs> I should start calling you Dr. Nature. Very well, Doc. I entrust my ankle's care to you. All right, that should do it. How's it feel? A little weird? No, it's nice and cool. Thanks, Doc. I'm just glad we found something to help you. The pain should ease with time, too. So, Welkin, what got you interested in nature to start with? Well, I don't know. I guess it had a lot to do with my dad's influence. General Gunther's? Yeah. Whenever he came home, we'd take a trip collecting bugs in the mountains or swimming. Somewhere along the way, going on those trips turned into a love of nature for me, too. The general out collecting bugs? That's unexpected. Maybe so. I guess other people see him as a big, stoic military hero. He had his own share of worries, though. Yeah? My mom died as a casualty of the first European war. Oh, damn. Eek. Parents. Parents dying. Never cool. Never fun. I don't think Dad ever got over the fact that he couldn't protect her. But everybody else was always praising him for being a great hero. The war won him respect and adulation, but it also cost him the love of his life. I think that always weighed on him. That question of what he fought the war for. I had no idea. But when he was out in the woods playing with me, he was always so bright and happy. Maybe I fell in love with nature because it always put the smile back on my dad's face. Oh, Welkin. Yeah, that's pretty touching. Yeah, like, that's a really good story point. Like, I really like that. Alright, so... Let's go through one more story cutscene here, and then we'll head into the second half of Chapter 8. <laughs> oh, shit. Alicia, someone's coming. Shoot him! Shoot him! Freeze! Oh, he's already Walk very in. dead. What? He's badly wounded. I'm surprised he can even walk. Help me! Welkin, do something! Well? It 
It's no use. The wound's way too deep. It hurts. It's so dark. Oh, God, Mother! Mother! It's okay. Don't be afraid. Mother's right here. Everything's fine. See? Yes. It's... Why, why does it always seem so much worse when it's a guy that's like begging not to have to go? Ah, oh, shit, man, that really fucking sucks. Oh, we've killed like dozens of them. And then one is just like, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, I'm not going to keep explaining it. Oh, it hurts. I just want to keep going, but I have to end the episode here. So thank you guys a lot for watching. Like, that's heavy. Hit the like button down below, I guess, if you're liking the series. Do the subscribe thing. Do the comment thing. Just like, I... Uh, uh, I can't do my usual, like, peppy, excited outro on that one. That's just... That sucks. <laughs>